Nine dead, 115. I don't know if they're killing off another 115 people or animal. I don't even know what they're killing. Aliens, maybe? But it's got Dan Campen from uh, Waking the Cadaver. I don't know who that is. This is off Slam Worldwide. It's probably going to be heavy. These guys are from Southern New Jersey, and they are a brutal death metal slam band. So we're going to get something heavy. You know the deal. Drop it down in the comments what you guys thought about this song. Get it on your playlist. All the links are down below. Show them some love and tell them that Orion sent you guys. Let's see what they got now. It's another Slam World production. Let's go. Let's get some chunky slam. <laughs> Chunky. <laughs> Loud snare. Let's go. Let's go. Ooh, a Toctosa sure? I really like reacting to them. This drummer's fun. Damn, I love the contrast with the drums and the chugs. It's definitely something different for me. Oh. Mm. Let's go, Seinfeld. Wheels. Yeah. Oh. Ting ting, motherfucker. Open this shit up. Mmm. I want more eyes. I don't even know where this is going. Okay. Open it up. What's element 115? What? It's a unique element when it's exposed to radiation. It produces its own Damn. gravitational field. Those drums are going off. Oh. Okay. Is somebody toilet clogged? He's got good vocals. This week, our series of reports on UFOs will learn a number of things that not everybody who sees a UFO is crazy. That our government has lied about UFO information, that it's withheld UFO files, and even spied on UFO witnesses. That's <laughs> a straight out bag. Elsewhere in the universe is virtually a certainty. And we heard that the majority of Americans believe that UFOs are real and come from space. 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 
Ah, uh, fuck. It's kind of funny because I, I didn't know what they were killing off of their animals or... <laughs> Or humans, and I think I actually said aliens. And the song is basically about area, uh, whatever the fucking thing is. Um, <laughs> area 51 is what it was. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking of. Anyway, th this is pretty cool. Uh, it's a little off for my kind of liking for metal. I mean, for death metal slam, it's it's brutal. <laughs> I mean, it's dun, 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 dun. very chuggy, uh, but uh, I mean, at the least, I can respect it a lot. There's lots of kicks. The drums were actually really cool in this as well. I really, uh, really dig those. A little bit different from what I'm used to hearing, so it kind of catches my ear a little bit more. The, the the vocals on this guy is really cool, too. It kind of gave me a little bit of that higher, like, Mitch Lucker kind of, like, screams, those very high screams. And we've done a reaction or two on Toctosa as well, and I know they, like, I even, like, like clickbaited once for their TikTok and it got a lot of views as well and uh, uh, obviously kind of re referenced it to Mitch Lucker and their highs and kind of sounded like uh, Suicide Silence so really neat to hear this as well it kind of goes hand in hand with it so it's kind of cool to see these uh, guys kind of supporting each other um, I don't know what kind of following these guys have but let me know down in the comments what you guys saw are you going to be rocking this one are you into this kind of metal I mean I feel like my palette has definitely been opening up a lot to this kind of stuff um, and it's funny because there's somebody that was, uh, I did a reaction to, uh, what was it? Scarlet Rot, which is, or yeah, Diggy Allen's project bin, and I didn't realize it was him, and then people are like, okay, now that you're getting into this, you should get back to, into, like, Infinite Annihilator. That's where it kind of clicked. And I'm like, okay, like, I, I might be, like, changing my, my pilot a lot, and I've noticed that a lot, too. So, anyways, go explore them. All the links are down below. Let us know what else we need to hear from them, uh, and something else that I would like. They even had a black in this, too. A little urgh or something like that. So, definitely mad respect to these guys a lot of fun check out some of these bands that are popping up here as well we're spreading so much love for these smaller bands i would love to see you guys go check them out give them some support and i'm just having a fun time showing you guys some of these bands so thanks so much and until next time toodaloo motherfuckers toodaloo